So this is where you spawn. Hey guys, Chocolate Muffin HD here, and today's video is going to be a little bit different to a normal video that I'd make on my channel. But I have come across a, a seed, a Minecraft seed on the Xbox, um, is it Bedrock Edition I think it is, it's the Windows 10 Edition. It is absolutely amazing. As you can see, some of my worlds here, so I've got some city worlds, I've got my hardcore world. And I, I just started this brand new world on the 13th of September. And um, it's my offline world, which is basically just for me to mess around. If I go onto it and I copy the seed, so here's, here's the seed. As you can see, the seed is right there. I can't actually hover or hover on it, but as you can see, go up one and you'll see the seed. So it's a little dash, 97233367. Now this seed is absolutely amazing. Why is it amazing? Because it has a village next to it, has another village next to it, has a mate, like one of the massive mansions, and it also has one of them pillager outposts. I'm going to recreate the world. So we're going to copy the world, and then we're going to go into creative, and then we're going to um, we're going to go into creative on this world, and then we're going to play, and then I'm going to show you like what's around my world. It's just easier basically to fly around than actually just walk around the world. I think this is a really good thing, and you know you might say it's a little bit cheaty because everything is basically near you, but um oh my Minecraft crashed. As I was saying, it might be a little bit cheaty because everything is basically near you. You've got a village outpost, you've got a mansion, and you've got like two villages next to you. But um, in my opinion, you know, their mansions are wet, like they're just so far away. And this is the best ever seed I've ever come across in my entire life. So let's just get, get rid of everything in my inventory. So this is where you spawn. Well, actually, you spawn down here. You, you spawn in like this little forest. But as you can see, we've got a very nice village that is um, here. And if we fly up, there should be another village down here somewhere. There was. Um, there should be another village down here. I think there was a village. Down. Yeah, uh, yeah. here we go. We got a nice little village here. Okay, we'll go check this out. And it's got a massive ravine next to it. And I've never seen a, a village like this. And there's another ravine down here. And, and we got a desert temple as well. Like this, what more could you want? So we got this nice little village here, and uh, if you want me to, I'll go in and have a look at the um, sand temple and have a look what kind of loot you can get in it. Might as well, and then we'll go show you the uh, mansions. Right, uh, we're gonna go in here. Gonna break that so I don't jump on it. So in here we got three emeralds, got some gold and iron, wood enchantment book which is fire aspect one, and just a saddle and stuff like that, normal stuff. But now let's go over here. Where there should be a mansion, like I think it, I don't know exactly what the name is called, but I presume it's just a mansion, or is it a mason? I I don't know what it's exactly called, but um yeah, if we fly back to the um the village where we started, if I can even find it, we went the wrong way, guys. That that is why I couldn't see my. That's why I couldn't see. We we went this way when we meant to go this way. But yeah, look, we got a ravine here, and we got a ravine there, and we've got like a, a little ravine there as well. We got three ravines, and this village is pretty nice to be honest. But it's a pretty nice area, really. It's not like it's like a horrible um, biome or anything. You've got and there's another ravine there. I don't know if I mentioned that, but yeah. Now over here to the left. So basically, when you've spawned, you spawn, you spawn over here, and you come across this village. And you're like, oh, that's a nice village. If we come down here, let it all load in. We should be granted by a masterpiece. Right, we're getting into the biomes. We're getting into like the little changey biomes. And boom, here we go, guys. And boom. Right, let's go check out the little villager outpost. It's not too far, is it? It's it's it is a really nice like little spawn area. Got um, no iron golem, but let's have a look in the chest. Got a nice. Ooh, that is a nice enchantment book. That's pretty good, guys. And then obviously we've got some nice little horses and stuff. But um, this mansion is just oh, it's really nice. Let's just break through the windows. Um, but yeah, you, this is um, the world. Obviously, um, everyone can go. Well, they can't join it, but you can go experience it for yourself. 
Uh, if we go recap, so we've got uh, a mansion, we've got two villages, we've got a sand temple, and you've got a villager outpost. Now that is amazing. What more could you want? If you enjoyed this video, remember to smash the like button and subscribe for more content. If I ever find anything else, so like if there's a... Um, the end portal or anything underneath one of these villages. I will make a quick update video. But other than that, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you later. Bye.